Everyone is okay? So how about in the other country? Hi, Janet. Um, I don't know, is there, are you, uh, you're from what country? And copper. Okay, 17. Yeah, hi, hi, good. Bunyamin, is that Bunyamin? Hello, good morning. Yeah, hi. Hi, finally I can, <laughs> I can see everything and we succeeded in technical problems. So we are officially with you now. <laughs> Thank you very much. As okay. a, as a, are you from Portugal? No, we are from Italy. Oh, sorry, Italy, yeah. So what we're going to do to access this presentation, just click, you ask them to click, you ask them to click the link from the uh, message box to join into this presentation. Uh, hello, uh, our students uh, will uh, join 10 minutes later because they uh, they are at lesson. Yeah, okay, so don't worry. Is that from Poland, from Portugal or? That's the Turkish students, Resi. Turkish, yeah, sorry. <laughs> Thank you, Josie, for your help. Okay, so shall we make a start or shall we wait a little bit? Resi, I think maybe start now and the other students can join us when they arrive because otherwise people will have to leave early for other lessons. Yeah, okay. All right, so um, I'm not sure, did we record this one? Did you record it, Shazi, or because it said record, so I don't know. Yes, I've started recording. Okay, so thanks, Shazi. Okay, so, so our lesson today, um, we have percentage of amount 
and percentage change. Okay, we'll look at the um, look at the uh, image. You can see fifty percent there. So where is that? Okay, we're going to discuss that uh, in a few minutes. So our lesson objective, at the end of this lesson, you'll be able to calculate percentages without using calculator or non-calculator. And you'll be able to know how to cal calculate percentage, percentages using calculator. I'm going to give you one example for that and know how to calculate percentages using calculator, change, sorry, percentages change using calculator. So I'm going to give you another example for that. Okay, so um, there are some sections that we do a menti quiz, and at the very end of this lesson, we're going to do Kahoot quiz. So I hope you enjoy the lesson. First, we're going to, so I need to know your knowledge first regarding the percentages. So can you write anything about percentages? The meaning where percentages are used or the formula. For example, in bank, you know, uh, bank interest. And also another example, ex stock exchange. Or you can, if you know the meaning in your language, you can put in your language. Yes, yeah, so just type it on. For anyone who has just joined, I've put the link in the chat for menti.com and the code that you need. Okay, so we have Istanowski. What does it mean? Increase, yeah, decrease, thank you. So decrease in percentages increase. How about today? Nowadays, you know, we have a COVID. Are they using percentage with that? So do some report. Yeah, thank you, discount. We have out of 100, well done. The stats, yeah, thank you. Discount. Yeah. A number ratio. Thank you very much. Percent is a number of ratio. Thank you. So anything else? Where can you see them? You remember the, the first picture that I've shown? Yeah, it could be, oh yes, you, you put discount, division, discount, yeah. Sale, yeah, sale, discount. Fraction of something. Items, yeah, in items, discount. Okay, so one minute more to do this. Is there any more? Yeah, you can say it in your language. Even we don't understand. Abbreviation, yeah, per city, percent. So, Ale, Hueco, Tunema. Is that the right um, reading? Thank you. 22 seconds more.
Okay, thank you. So we're going to do, to view the next one. Thank you very much for your answer. Okay, so we're going to do percentages of amounts. So how could we calculate the given percentage of a quantity without using calculator? So we have 50% or you can do half it or one half or divide it by two. So the 25% half it, one half, then half it again. And, or you have to divide it by four. And the next one is 10%. So you divide it by 10, or you can use a decimal with this. Yes, yeah, so you move one to the left, one decimal, and then 5% divided by 10, then divided by two or half it and then 1% divided by 100. Okay, we're going to discuss this one by one, the subtopic, and there is a quiz after the discussion. So I'm going to show an example, and the following is the quiz, okay? We're going to do the 50%, for example, 50%, so half it, or you divide it by two, so we have 50% of 180. So if you are in a store, yeah, you don't need calculator, just half it, okay? So we have 90, okay? So are you ready to do the quiz? Okay, so we're going to do the quiz now for this. Okay, menti.com quiz. So you need to write, as soon as we go to the next uh, presentation, you're going to write your name in a character and um, thus UK, all right? For the UK and for the other country, you can put Italy or put IT, Portugal, um, oh, oh, who else in here? Poland. And uh, did I say Turkey and Italy? Okay, so now we move on. Put your name, underscore your country. All right, so choose a character and put your name, underscore your country. Wow, it's a lot of uh, character here. Well done. Okay, 28, 29, 30, 31. Good, well done. We are 38, 38 in here. Is that it? Is that everyone? Okay, so 31 join, thank you. I'm going to press enter. Find 50% 50 50 of 1,250 kilograms. Time's up. Thank you. So the correct answer is 625. Well done for those who get the correct answer. And we'll see who's the faster. Okay, so we have Andre from the UK, 978 points. Okay, we move on to the next subtopic. So we have 25%. So you're going to have it, then have it again, or 
you divide it by four. For example, we have 25% of 500 kilograms. So you half it is 50 and then you half it again is 125 kilograms. So are you ready?